West Indies skipper Darren Sammy won the toss and chose to bat. Michael Clark had no complaints. Uh, I was going to bowl first, so uh, not a bad toss to lose. And so it proved. Clint Mackay got things rolling in the fifth over. Beautifully, Finch dives to his right. Enter Mitchell Stark, who proceeded to tear the heart out of the tourists' lineup with four wickets in eight deliveries. Big in swinging Yorker might be close. Oh yes, it doesn't matter, forget the LBW, just knock the stumps out of the ground, will you? First game of James Faulkner joined the party with wickets in his first two overs. The wind is nudging Oblivion at 7 for 39. Edge, another one to Michael Clark. good length from James Faulkner. Sammy led a brief rearguard, top scoring with 16. Sammy on the charge, bang, caught that. But when he fell to Mackay, oh, that's popped up and out. In the the innings folded the quickly. There it is. Five wickets for Mitchell Stark. Second time in his career, but they're his best figures. And what a performance. 6.5 overs, two of the maidens, five for 20. And the West Indies have been dismissed for 70. Promoted to open, teeth, Glenn Maxwell the, exploded the from wrong. the blocks, smashing 18 from Kimar Roach's opening over. <laughs> Oh, bang! What an early statement this is from Glenn Maxwell. Two boundaries in the first three balls. Everything that happened afterwards. He comes again! This one is hit even better! That's gone ten rows back! The Aussies lost Aaron Finch for ten, but the audacious Maxwell, who finished unbeaten on 51 from 34 deliveries, ensured an easy victory. The target achieved inside ten overs. And that'll be it. Game over. And it's 1 0 to Australia. Uh, that was good fun out there. Uh, I think I stayed with the job to do and just try to do as well as I could.